y'all. Here I am, and I thought, you know, let's make a vlog my day. I've never done that before, and I hope it's something y'all find interesting. I'm going to be, you know, sharing my little tips of life and whatnot with y'all as well. And remember to stay tuned because I have an exciting announcement for y'all. And I think I'm gonna have a fun day with y'all so I won't be all alone, so yay. But now you know it's breakfast time. That's good. I used garlic salt, onion powder, and tajin. And I love it. Anyway. Yes. Soon I'll be getting into life. Okay, what I have just done, I wake up, go to the bathroom, pray, do my exercises, get dressed, and I went for a walk with my mom, came back and did my devotionals, and yeah, here I am at breakfast. That's what I've done so far, so. Y'all aren't gonna be so excited for what's next. I'm not. <laughs> Y'all, guess what time it is? Math time! But good news, I only have tests left. So I have my unit test and then my final test and I'm done forever. <sighs> oh, sounds nice. Hopefully I can do it, y'all, hopefully. This is my last subject left to finish. If you don't know, I'm homeschooled, so yeah. It's great until you like skipped math like a lot, a lot because you're really busy. And so it's like in the summer and you're like, oh, you mean I still have to do that? Yeah, that's what happened. So here we are, wish me luck. Y'all, so I finished my unit test. Oh, there were some moments where I'm like, I don't know what to do. But good thing I thought, and you know what? Even if I didn't remember all those fancy equations, I figured it out, and I think I did really well. So, yeah, I'm happy. And you know what? I just have one test left. That's not that bad. I can do this. And in fact, when you see this video, I'm going to be done with math. So, oh, I think I should just start celebrating now. Let's go! Woohoo! Thank you, thank you. I'm so happy. Wait, what do I do with my life now? I know I have a lot of important stuff I need to do, but I kind of want to just relax and enjoy finishing math for like a minute. So I think I'm going to go for another walk. Hi, Emma. Shy. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> yes, so y'all, I went on my amazing walk, and that was amazing, obviously. And now I am hanging in the hammock. What? Okay, y'all, I'm not gonna be mean and make y'all wait like the entire video to find out what my life update is. So, y'all, I'm gonna tell you now, I'm going to Mexico in a few days. I am so excited. Maybe you already knew that, but maybe not. And I know you're excited with me because you know how much I absolutely love Mexico. So yes, yes, I'm just, I'm incredibly happy. But y'all, like it's a little nervous. Like, you know, I speak Spanish, but like, it's a whole different world out there, you know? Like, I hope I'm ready. Like, ah, oh. and I'm the only one on our team going that knows Spanish. So yeah, that's that's that. And then you know, like my friend there, Pancho, speaks Spanish, but you know, I mean English, yeah. But still, it's like he's not gonna interpret for me. Like I need to, I need to be able to speak Spanish. And I'm mean, like me and this other guy are like leading the children's services and stuff. And so yeah, like in Spanish. I probably can count the amount of like messages I've given on one hand and yet yeah, I'm gonna be giving one in Spanish and that's like that's a lot for me okay and honestly it's like I can't do that but like I'm not gonna be doing that like 
God is. Like, I honestly cannot do this on my own. I am terrified on my own. But, like, I trust that God's gonna help me. So, yeah, it's, it's gonna be amazing. I know that. And, like, I'm excited to see what God's gonna do. And I definitely know that I'm going to be growing on this trip. So, yeah. Y'all, wish me luck. <sighs> but, yes, I'm super excited. But, like, how to practice for my lessons and stuff? Like, I want to be prepared. Like, obviously, I'm trusting God, but that doesn't mean I'm going to be, like, an idiot and not do anything to get ready. Okay, so, I think I'm going to be going to, like, go through it in English, figure out what I actually want to say and share and the main idea and all that. And then practice, like, like read through the scripture in Spanish and then practice giving it in Spanish. Okay, also, my brother just got up and asked me if I wanted to go to my grandma's house with him. So, I think I'm going to do that, too. I think I can fit it into my busy schedule. So, yeah, let's, that's fun. Let's go. Let's do it. Y'all, look at me remembering to brush my hair hat and do it. I just wanted to tell y'all a quick little fact. So... I took a shower last night, right? I braid my hair to sleep because that protects it, helps it grow long and beautiful, right? Not break off. And then now I unbraid it and rebrush it and then like rebraid it, right? Fun fact though, my hair is still damp. It's been what? More than 12 hours? Still wet. Yes, my hair stays wet a long time, especially if it's braided, but it drips like everywhere. It holds it holds so much water, okay, y'all? I just want y'all to understand that. And now I'm gonna braid my hair. And y'all, I think everyone should know how to braid hair, even boys, because y'all, I guarantee you, one day it's gonna come in handy, whether it's with your wife or your daughter or your niece or your grandma, I don't care. But it's a nice skill to know. So I guess, should I teach you? No, you, you know how to, like, you can learn, okay? You can do it. You can do it. Y'all, so I also wanted to tell you a quick little thing. Why do girls love their hair so much? Because they spend a lot of time with it, okay? If you spend that much time with something, you love it too, okay? Y'all, I spend more time with my hair than I do with most of my friends. That's just facts. So, yeah, obviously I care about it, but I try not to be like obsessed with it, okay? It is just hair at the end of the day, and it does grow back. Y'all, multitasking is key, though. Like, doing something while doing your hair makes life easier because, yeah, ain't nobody got time for that. So, we just got back from Grandma's house. That was fun, but we cleaned the pool some. Well, not exactly clean, but like added salt and stuff and trying to get her pool up and running so we can go swimming soon. It's been a process though. It's, it's getting there. Poco a poco. And y'all, I stepped in an ant bed and got a bunch of bites, y'all. That's like life in Texas, y'all. Those fire ants will get you, okay? So watch out for that. And yeah, now, tengo hambre. Go eat some lunch, so yeah. Let's see what I can find. So y'all, I just ate lunch and went for a nice, wonderful walk. And now I'm ready to get into it, work hard on my lessons, and yeah, I'm so excited. I'm gonna be honest, I have not been practicing languages quite as much as I wish I was. I think I've just been busy, and y'all, let me be honest, being a teenager, it's like, ah, like, so much is changing, like, so much responsibility, and trying to balance, like, growing up, but still, like, enjoying being a kid and stuff, and so, yeah, I've been struggling with that lately, and, yeah, but let's go, let's practice some Spanish, like, learn, figure out life, get ready for my trip, and I'm so excited. Yeah, let's go. Hey, y'all. Taking a break. I don't know about you, but like in order ah, in order to be productive, like you have to take breaks sometimes. And yeah, I was just getting kind of tired, and so here I am. I did my laundry and I'm doing my drops, relaxing in this nice hammock chair. And yeah, kind of texting some of my friends and just chillaxing for a bit before I get back into it. But y'all, I'm tired. I want to take a nap, but I can't. At least not yet. Maybe later, y'all. 
Well, so much for that, y'all. I just took a nap. It was nice. Hopefully it'll help me, yeah, have more energy and go do things. Y'all, this is a chair and I fell asleep in it, but, oh, I enjoyed it. Yeah, enjoy life, y'all, enjoy it. Y'all, why am I so lazy? I mean, really, I feel lazy and don't want to do, like, stuff. Just want to take another nap. But you know what? I got some vitamins, juice, yeah, and a plum, y'all. And let's go. Maybe this will give me some energy. I can do this. Y'all are encouraging me. I know that. So let's go. Hey, y'all. So, y'all, I worked on my sermon or whatever you want to call it. And I was scared. I'm going to be honest. I was so scared. But it turned out so good. Like, honestly, I'm so surprised. Like, I was crying, y'all. I'm going to be honest. But, like, God came. And honestly, I was preaching to myself. Like, I need to hear him. But I definitely feel more prepared for Mexico. And I believe it's going to be amazing. And, y'all, I ate dinner. And, I don't know, maybe something else. I can't remember. Yeah. And now it's time for church. So, yeah, I'm going to go to church. And, yeah, I'm excited. <laughs> Hey, so we just got back from church and it was just so amazing. Exactly what I needed to hear. And y'all, I'm sorry. I didn't mean for this to like, I don't know, be all about God. But y'all, I wanted to give you an authentic experience of my day. And that is how my day was. So there you go. Honestly, I, I'm so ready for Mexico. Like, y'all, I am ready. I am still scared, but I am ready. God is with me and it's gonna be amazing. I know it. Yeah, let's go. I'm gonna take a shower, so yeah, see y'all later. Sorry I talk so fast. I'm excited. Y'all, I am just so on fire. It's not even funny. I have been like preaching to myself and I don't know, God is just so alive and God is so good and it is so amazing. And y'all, I could preach you a sermon right now. Like, I could. I really could. And I almost want to. But y'all, I probably don't have time for that. Oh, I wish I did though. But y'all, honestly, I encourage you to go to church. Hear what they have to say. Because I want you to have the amazing gift that I have. And that's just what I want to share with you. And y'all, I'm going to go pray now. Because I like to, you know, like, wind my day down with that. And yeah, and then I'm gonna read my Bible. Yes, Santa Biblia. I love it. I have so many Bibles, it's amazing. Okay, yeah, I love you. Hey y'all, I finished and now I'm just listening to some of my favorite Mexican music. And now I'm going to write in my journal. And I like to do that at night just to unwind and then, like, honestly, remember the important moments of my life. And yeah, that's my fun. So, yeah, honestly, I recommend journaling to y'all. Personally, for me, writing is just the best outlet ever. So, I do this to stay balanced and practice languages. Hey, y'all. Well, I'm ready to go to sleep. I had a wonderful day with y'all. Thank you so much for spending it with me. And yeah, I hope this gives you a little peek into my life. If you thought this was horrible, I am so sorry. I am not great at vlogging yet, but oh well. Please subscribe if you enjoy my content and want to see more of me. And yeah, like this video please. And goodbye, I'll see you in my next video. Good night.